Butte College football is gearing up for its first game in nearly two years. Sports director Jenna Fink went out to Butte College today. She shows us what the Roadrunners are doing to get ready to hit the gridiron. November 23rd, 2019 was the last time Butte football played in an actual game. It was a 38-28 win over the College of the Sequoias. Nearly two years later, the Roadrunners are preparing for a game against the same team. It's a little ironic. I don't know if there's any other matchups like that going on. Uh, they have a new coach now, and so it's a little bit different. Um, you know, we all have new players and new staff, so it's kind of one of those things that you don't really know. First game of the year, uh, at this level especially, you don't really know what you're going to have. Two very different teams will be on that field, but Coach Schnelling knows the talent he has on his team, starting with quarterback Brian Harper, a sophomore who was part of the Roadrunners in 2019. He's an unbelievable athlete, and so there's some things we can do with him uh, at the quarterback position that, that give us an advantage, and he's a guy that, you know, sitting here last spring having a small track season in spring of 21, I mean, he's beating our receivers and our DBs and our tailbacks in the 100. And so I'd say I'm a dual threat quarterback. Uh, I like to run around, but I mean, I like to throw too. This is Harper's first year taking the reins as starting QB. I've been working to get bigger and stronger, but for me, my main thing was just mentally trying to be sharper. The Roadrunners' first game against the College of the Sequoias is this Saturday. Reporting at Butte College, Jenna Fink, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Coming up at